Hello, my name is Scott. I'm a lead maintenance technician. My day starts with assigning the required tasks to the crew to accomplish our daily goals. And then throughout the day, I monitor those tasks and assist as required. Or some of the tasks that we, we do as maintenance technicians is we remove and replace engines, uh, remove and replace landing gear, we remove and replace flight controls, and after we install these components, we perform ops checks to make sure that they operate correctly. One day I may be in the cockpit running flight controls for, to perform system operational checks. Other times I might jump in to spot for a crew that's installing an engine to make sure nothing gets damaged. Our hours usually run 10 hours a day, 50 hours a week. Our stress level averages low, but at times it can get extremely high when we're trying to meet a certain deadline or a milestone or prepare an aircraft for flight. You'll need to start as an aircraft technician and to become an aircraft technician, you can go through a two year school to get your certifications or you can join the military and get your training through them. And then after you gain experience, getting an associate's degree in aircraft maintenance technology will also help you with the written and communication and computer skills needed to perform duties while a lead technician. The best part of my job is finding a problem that fixed an issue on aircraft and then watching that aircraft fly away and feel the sense of accomplishment. Some people might say that the worst parts of this job is the high levels of stress, uh, sometimes harsh environments. We deal with uh, harsh chemicals, jet fuel. We also have to go in confined spaces like fuel tank entry. Also, probably the number one complaint of mechanics is hydraulic fluid that burns your skin. If you're in high school and you're interested in, in an aviation career, uh, consider a vocational class that would give you that mechanical background and the foundation that you need. One thing you need to be ready for is that even though an airplane looks clean, it is a dirty job and you will get grease all over you. If you're considering a career in aviation, don't just do it for the money. Do it for uh, interest in aviation. It can be a very rewarding career.